gonna do today. First up, we're gonna take a look at something. This is our old Panasonic GH4. We have filmed many an episode of Adventure Archives with this. In fact, we filmed our first 4K episode in Red River Gorge with this very camera, which has been through the ringer. It is mostly still rock solid, but the screen does not work at all anymore. Now, I have no way of exposing or focusing this properly, so it's on autofocus. This camera at this point has some sentimental value because we've been using it for so long. I sold some of our first cameras. I don't feel bad about those at all. I have no nostalgia towards them because the quality was so bad. But this camera, man, this camera, I feel like there's gotta be some way I can repurpose this for a fun purpose. But I don't know what. Well, for now, I'm gonna use this for the big live stream we're gonna do next week and just use it as an alternate camera. The device I ordered should be here tomorrow. And that's gonna be very fun to try out and I can show you how cool it's gonna be. Woo! That's gonna be good. Okay, we'll let that simmer for a bit. For now, I wanna try out a couple things. First, what does this camera look like as a webcam? This is what my computer's webcam looks like and it is fine. However, we can also hook up my phone. Look at this, man, this is magic. We're just wirelessly connected to my computer using it as a webcam. That is a great technology. But let's see what it would look like if I use my camera. We just need a couple of cables, USB-C adapter, USB-C cable. We just plug one end into the camera, other end into my computer. Actually, never mind because it does not seem to be working. And you know what? I'm not even gonna mess with it. It doesn't matter. Other things to try today. Old GoPro. You know, now that I think about it, that is one reason why I sell things is because if they're just sitting in my closet, I feel like I should be using them. If I'm not using them, somebody should be using them, right? We should try this thing out. Like I said, I can use these as extra cameras for the live stream. Let us test these out. Start with the GH. Yo, this is still, still pretty decent. Not bad. Man, it is crazy how dirty the old GH4 image is. It's just so noisy and messy. It kind of has an appeal though. Just like this dirty, messy image. Okay, so now, same thing. I'm gonna use the GoPro. Oh, that! That's ugly. Woo. I thought the GH4 was dirty. Oh my God. Okay, you know, actually that's not bad. Maybe something was wrong with it just a second ago. That actually looks decent. That might, it's a little better than the GH4 actually. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. I don't know if it's genetic or what, but there are some people like myself who just love like hooking stuff up and doing like live production stuff. And do you know what I mean? The thought of having multiple cameras hooked up to a little switcher that I can switch around is so exciting to me. And maybe to lots of people that's like, that doesn't sound fun at all. To a certain type of person, and you know who you are, that is super fun. If you've ever been like me and you've wondered what's the difference between professional gear and just regular consumer gear, nine times out of 10, it's durability. I don't know how much this tripod costs, but it was probably like $20 at most. This tripod, costs over $300, and this thing is built like a tank. An absolute tank. What was I doing with this? GoPro. You know, I actually still am curious how the audio quality compares. This has a little microphone attachment on this old GoPro. I believe it was called the Media Mod, and then the newer GoPro, I don't have that. So let's see how that sounds. This is a... Uh, the media mod attachment. Let's um, try out this one as well. Okay, and this is the newer GoPro without the microphone attachment. How does it sound? No idea. Does it matter? Not really. Who's gonna use the sound from a GoPro really? Plenty of people probably. Okay, there might be a very slight advantage to this microphone over the built-in microphone, but uh, it's not a huge advantage. That is exciting though, I could use this. What could I use this for? Like some sort of, just like always on camera. What would I have a need for that for? I wouldn't.
one of my litmus tests is to see if I can still touch the rim on a basketball hoop. I think that might be a realistic goal to be able to do that for most of the rest of my life. We shall see. Not bad. Ultimate struggle right now. I basically hit my max heart rate immediately as soon as I start running hard. But I've been feeling good the whole run. Metrics are fun, but really when it comes to exercise, you can use how you feel as a barometer. I don't think everything's like that because if you always listen to your body, as they say, you'll eat chocolate chip cookies and do cocaine. <laughs> I've never done cocaine, don't worry. Do you have any idea how much I love this car? The luck of a lifetime. What? What? What were you trying to say? <laughs> Just unbelievably good luck getting this car. Alright, I just went to the post office. If you would like to send us a package, let me know on Patreon. You do not need to be a paying member. You can just sign up for a free account. Send us a message. This is a COVID test. This is unrelated. We got something from Patty. Ah! Ho, ho, ho. Always gotta check the card first. It is two golden retrievers driving a car. Dear Robbie, Andrew, Brian, and Thomas. I have watched every one of your videos, most at least two times. I'm 80 year, hold on. Is this correct? I'm 80 years old. Some of the handwriting got a little bit hard to read here. And then the last line says, I hope you can read my writing. <laughs> Betty, I can mostly read it. There's just a few lines. So I love, I still love to travel and go on something work with a personal trainer. It, in parentheses, life just keeps getting better. Patty, thank you so much. Fantastic card. Oh, oh, the Lost Coast, that is too funny. That is awesome. And on the back, Adventure Archives. Oh man. Patty, that is so cool. Who, who came up with this idea? Hikermetals.com? Here's a free shout out, hikermetals.com. Very cool. Thanks again, Patty. All right, I feel like we gotta find a better spot for this metal than just up on the shelf. All right, yes, yes. Anyways, like I said, that live stream equipment is gonna come tomorrow. We're gonna set that up, test it out. Um, but until then, thank you for watching. Hope you have a good one. See you in the next one, which might be right now. Or it might be later. Is this correct? I'm 80 years old. I'm 80 years old and still love to travel and go This, Patty, first of all, thank you so much for the card.